Y'all get ready? Yes, you get Hell ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, it's your girl T. So I want to come on here and spill some Floyd Mayweather tea for y'all, okay? So if you guys don't know, it's currently going down. So yesterday, Floyd Mayweather got a chance to meet Takashi 6 9 He was just as excited as Takashi was. Y'all go ahead and check out this video really quick. <laughs> All right, so you guys just saw that video of Floyd and Takashi 6 9 getting a chance to meet each other. So now if that's not crazy enough, for the latest chick in Floyd Mayweather's so-called collection, her name is Jennifer Duran. Now, I don't know where the hell she came from or how long he's been fucking her, but she did manage to secure that bag, okay? So congratulations, sis. We see you, bitch, okay? So she has officially secured the bag by getting knocked up by Floyd Mayweather. This is her first child, and this is his fifth child by his fifth baby mama, okay? So so what's going down is that of course this beautiful Dominican woman she ran to Instagram to share her joy with the world and to let everybody know that she is officially knocked up with her bundle of joy aka her new cash <laughs> That she's now knocked up with her own cash app, okay? Go ahead and check out this video of Jen Duran posting her pregnancy. Go ahead and check this out and I'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary. Honey, so you guys just saw her. So they also posted that on the shade room. Now, what's crazy is that since 2014, he's been dating this chick named Dorlai, aka Bad Medina, and she's Latina, beautiful girl. She's an Instagram model. And anyhow, they've been dating off and on since 2014. So much so, it was just five months ago that Bad Medina and Floyd Mayweather's other babe mama, they were literally beefing over a chinchilla jacket, honey. When I tell you, they went back and forth for days because, because Floyd Mayweather allowed his baby's mother to wear his chinchilla coat. It was just a bunch of mess. So now that was five months ago when they were going back and forth. So obviously Floyd Mayweather was with her less than five months ago. So people in the shade room was like, okay, hold up now. We don't know where this little young girl came from, but damn, she got knocked up fast. She did something that Bat Medina couldn't even do. So of course, Bat Medina decided to pay a visit into the shade room and she decided to tell her side of the story. Y'all go ahead and check out this shit and I'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary. So as Cruzo3 says, she did what at Bat Medina couldn't do in years. At Bat Medina decides to reply back and she says, I'd rather have a husband than a baby. Money isn't everything. Real love is. If you think he didn't try locking me in, better yet knocking me up, you're wrong. I chose to leave and not have his child. Honestly, congratulations. You're going to be like Melissa, strung along with nice things. I loved, but I've never been in love. I still believe in love. Then she goes on to respond to somebody else. So Leo Life says, at Bad Medina 100, great response minus the dig at Melissa. Bad Medina then says, it's too much to write. I just gave the best example. I had no idea he was sleeping with her till she tried to fight me in the club. I'm not blind. I know how to move on. Then she goes on to post this video. Check this out. Come on. Come on. Now, for somebody who's not pressed, she's shown up writing all in the shade room and spilling her guts and everything else. And then she also posted that video. So I do think she is kind of bothered because, like I said, nobody even knows where this Jennifer chick came from. But she sure did manage to get knocked up fairly quickly, okay? So now the crazy thing is Fort Mayweather's baby's mother, Melissa, the one that Bad Medina was beefing with five months ago, she was spilling some other tea. And this is what she had to say. She was calling out Bat Medina for not being able to get pregnant. So this is what Melissa had to say five months ago. So Melissa says, at Bat Medina, you're right, bitch. I was never around when you were because I'm not a part of the collection. You wanted to be a baby mama, but your eggs were rotten. 
So, honey, that's supposedly the true tea as to why Bat Medina hadn't been able to get pregnant by Floyd Mayweather, but let her tell it she didn't want to have his child, okay? So now what's crazy is that Floyd Mayweather is basically responding to her. And in this video of him and Jennifer, I wasn't feeling it. He just basically talks about all these females like they're just dolls on the shelf and he can have his pick, which he can because he has money, he has fame, he has status. And that's how men with money, fame, and status behave. But the way he was talking was just so disgusting, especially being that this girl's pregnant and she's just sitting there looking like a damn trophy. Y'all go ahead and check out this video for Mayweather addressing this situation. Check this out and I'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary. Go deal with a man. Then you already know that that woman really liked that man. So that's why I think men be, you know, catching feelings. See, y'all gotta be built like me, my man. I'm cold hearted. You know what I'm saying? I'm cold hearted. I'm more like, okay, it is what it is. And I just feel like this. When a girl is with me, it's just like, it's just like real estate. You know, when I move into a, a home or, or I move into a neighborhood, the value of all up, the value of all the houses and different properties in that area goes up in value. But and it's just like this, because you really just look. You look at any girl that that's any girl that's dealt with me, right? If she left, if she left, or we went our separate ways and we didn't see eye to eye, you go look. Uh, you go to Forbes and look up what I'm worth and look up what he's worth. And, and, and it, don't, it don't got nothing to do basically with money. Okay? I want to tell everybody this. It don't got nothing to do with money. Awesome. Say, so who got the most girls? Who got the most girls? What's the appointment? No. What? Just, I don't know, Jen. You know I got the most girls. You know, Jen. <laughs> This fucking food good. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. What's up? You shit, you got a hangover shit. I I don't cause I don't drink. But I be making them think I drink when I be having the having the wine glass. Where the fuck y'all at? Y'all up early? Hold on. Honey, now you just saw all that mush mouth shit that Floyd Mayweather was talking, okay? I could barely understand what the hell he was talking about. And my thing is, let's keep it real. If it wasn't for him having all the money, the fame and status, he probably wouldn't have half the damn women in his collection that he's been able to have. I will give him props. He'd be pulling some badass bitches. But let's keep it real. He pulls these badass bitches because of who he is. Not because he has a personality. And definitely not because he has a gift of gab, okay? So anyways, congratulations to you, Floyd Mayweather, on your fifth child on the way. Congratulations to Jennifer Duran, bitch. You done secured that damn bag, honey, okay? We see you. So Anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire messy situation, honey. Once again, concerning Floyd Mayweather and his damn collection of females going back and forth on social media and his latest collection announcing to the world that she is indeed knocked up by Floyd Mayweather. So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. All right, deuces. <laughs> Hey you guys, it's your girl T and I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you want to know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals, definitely feel free to click my description box. There's plenty of information in there. Please stay tuned for the next video. Talk to y'all later.